Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing a rainbow loom tutorial. You will definitely need white and black, but you can use whatever colour you want, but I'm using orange. To start off with, you're going to make sure that your arrows are facing away from you, and also that the middle peg is above the two side ones. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go from the middle to the left. Always make sure that you've got two bands. Then you're going to get another two bands, push that one down, and you're going to go down three times. One, two, three. Then you're going to double up and add two white ones. So now you're going to get double orange and do it from the middle straight down. Then repeat that step all the way down three times, like that. Now you're going to get two whites and just push them on there, like that. So next you're going to go from the middle to the right with double bands and then go down three times. One, two... Three, and then don't forget to put your double white at the end. This is what it should look like once you've done all those steps. Next, you're going to get double black and put it from the center, from white right to there, and then that second peg to make it look like this. Now you're going to get an orange band and put it to this from the left peg to the right peg then you're going to put it upwards to make a triangle shape then you're going to repeat that on the next left to right peg and pull it up then you're going to do it one more time on the white ones left to right pull it up right finally you're going to get a white one and do that exact same step like so next you're going to spin your loom around like that and you're going to get this white band and pull it forward so it looks like that. If it comes off a bit like that, there, just pull it forward. Now you're going to get a black band and you're going to wrap it round there three times. Three. Done. Now, so now you're going to get a band, you're going to wrap it round three times. Just like you did with that black one. One, two, three. Then you're going to repeat it on the other side. One, two, three. Now you're going to pull back all three of them top one and reach in and get those two bottom bands and hold on to your cap band and pull it forward like so so next you're going to pull back this cap band and reach in and get these two bottom ones pull it forward then you're just going to repeat that and you're just going to keep reaching in and getting these top these two bottom bands once again all the way to the end like that once you get to the end like this you're going to reach in for this band and just pull it diagonally now you're going to pull back your two, your cap band and reach in for those two bottom ones and pull it forward if you realize that you've only pulled back one pull, for, pull forward one reach in for that other one because it'll just go on top like that okay. now you're going to reach in grab them two bottom bands and pull that forward like that then what you're going to do is keep reaching in for those bottom two bands pulling them forward bottom two bands pull them forward and so on bottom two bands pull it forward 
bottom two bands and pull it to the last peg, like that. Remember to push them all down so they keep on. You don't want any of them falling out, falling off, because that could mess up the whole process. Now you're going to pull back these cat bands once again and reach in for these bottom two bands. Pull them forward like so. Then pull back that cat band. Pull them forward. Pull always pull the two forward though. Don't you only need to pull the single cat band back and pull the two forward, single cat band back. And then you're going to get this band, two of them, like that. This is what it should look like so far. Now you're going to push your hook through all these bands, so like that. Put an orange band on. And pull it free. Sorry about that, it didn't work. So, like that. Pull it free. Like that. I think that's. Like that. Now, you're going to pull this one to the hook, edge hook, and pull this one over and tighten it so you've made a little knot like that now you're going to take it off I like starting at the bottom because these are the loosest bits like that yeah. then you're going to loosen these side bits and then this side bit this side bit this side bit forward and just going to Pull it all off until it looks like this. As you can see, it's probably bent, so you're going to like out of shape. So you're just going to pull it into shape, and this is what it should look like. You can do all different colours like this one. I've done a purple one yellow one and a really tiny blue one which I only need single bands for which turned out perfect just like the other ones so thanks for watching my video please comment down below if you want me to make any other rainbow loom charm videos.